Hi guys, this is Vicki Ash with OSP Shooting School. I've got a drill for you. We call it the three bullet drill. We put up three bullets on a bar, on a countertop, anywhere you want to. And if you don't have three bullets, put up three glasses. It doesn't really make any difference. We've got this bullet here in the middle and you want them about eight to 10 inches apart. Got one to the left, got one to the right. Gil's gonna demonstrate here in a minute how you're going to look at the center bullet and mount the gun on the right bullet. This would simulate the correct sight picture for a right-handed shooter on a left-to-right crossing target, with the middle bullet simulating the bird and the right bullet simulating where the gun would insert. In this situation, the shooter will be looking at the bird to the left of the barrel. Hold that for a few minutes and make sure that your eyes never come off the center bullet that they stay focused on it the whole time. Dismount, look at the center bullet, and mount the gun on the left bullet. This would simulate the correct sight picture for a right-handed shooter on a right-to-left crossing target. In this situation, the shooter will be looking at the bird across the barrel. Which is a very confusing sight picture for most right-handed shooters. Now, you left-handed shooters, it's the other way around. You look at the center bullet and mount on the left bullet first, then your eyes are on one side of the gun. Dismount, look at the center bullet, mount the gun on the right bullet where you're having to look across the gun. Confusing because your eyes always want to go back to that gun. What we're trying to do in this drill is to let you accept the gun in your periphery without your eyes going to it. Let's watch as Gil demonstrates. Always an empty gun when you're doing the drill. Okay. Okay, you're going to focus on the center bullet there and mount the gun on the right bullet. To show how you're looking down the left side of the gun so that both eyes are on one side of the gun and it's not confusing. Okay, lower the gun, focus on the center bullet and mount the gun on the left bullet. This is the confusing one for every right-handed shooter because that gun is in the way. So you want to get used to looking across the gun at the target so that there's no interference. Don't do it too fast though, this time do it nice and slow. The slower the better. Now you've done your practice. You don't mind having that gun up in your periphery. Where do you go shoot? Where to shoot? Org. Thousands of listings of places near you to go and shoot, make noise, break things, have a ball. But remember, firearm safety depends on you.